morning vlog family um so i still have my bags down here and i've been wanting to share with you what i got the other day and i actually went to the mall because we needed new hand soaps because we were out in the kitchen and then also in the upstairs bathroom so i think i'll start off with that so i went to bath and body works and i haven't been there in ages actually i haven't shopped there in like months and months and months um, and I'm making toast right now, <laughs> but uh, they actually had all their hand soaps all these ones for two dollars each so I got the coconut blossom and then um, What's this one right here fresh rain and spearmint? And then this one salted uh, bergamot And I just ended up getting a ton of them turquoise waters and then another one. Some of them are doubles. And then, yeah, that one I have three of. And then coconut again. So yeah, I'm really excited because now we are stocked up on these and I couldn't believe they were $2. That was just like an awesome price. And then right here I got this as well and it's a little candle holder. I just thought it was really bedazzled and sometimes like I buy these, I know they're expensive but if they're really cute like that, then I'll get them. And I just ended up getting two candles. I actually got this one for Ryan. It says you're the best dad and it smells like a men's fragrance and it smells really good like a cologne. So I got that and then the next one I got was this one right here, which I thought was so pretty looking. So it says Sunkiss Bronze Goddess and it's just got this really nice picture of the beach, palm trees. And I just thought this was so pretty. So I got that one too. And I think that's it. Yeah, that's everything that I got at Bath and Body Works. Okay, so the other stuff I got here, I actually stopped at Garage because I wanted to see if they had any cute um, like tube top like dresses because that's pretty much what I've been wearing for the last week just because it's comfortable and this week um, I've felt a major like weight gain. Um, so the babies are really growing rapid or rapidly and I actually have my doctor's appointment coming up on July 3rd. So after July 3rd, I actually have an appointment every single week and I can't believe we're already at that point. <laughs> but I ended up getting a one-piece bathing suit right here because um, obviously the bathing suits that I had, they're not fitting properly anymore. So I just wanted to get something that was a bit bigger. So this is a medium size that I got and it's got like flowers all over it. I, I just thought it was really pretty. Um, so it's light pink and it's got like green floral in it. And then I also got these. I thought these were really cool since we actually had Ryan's um, friend's kids here the other day. And I realized, I'm like, we don't have any pool floaties. We don't have anything fun for them. So I just thought these would be kind of cool to have in the pool. And they're big heart pool floats, which I didn't even know Garage had. Um, but they were, yeah, they were 30 each, but they were on sale. So I think I got them for like $20. Okay, so I actually got something for when I'm not pregnant anymore because this was on sale. Um, it's a medium size. I mean, I could wear this right now, but I just wouldn't know what kind of bottom to wear with it. But I just thought this was really, really cute. It's an off the shoulder. And I love the pattern and the colors, and I just love it. It's so cute. And I got this for $15. Okay, so now into Marshalls. You guys know that's kind of been my spot since they get really awesome stuff in. Um, so I ended up getting these two dresses right here for the girls, two sets of dresses. And I saw these, and I just fell in love. I thought they were so cute. Like, look at the coral color. So these ones are nine months, so they'll be for next summer. And I just, I loved these colors. And I haven't bought them anything this color yet. This, like, salmon pink coral color. So I got these, and they were $12.99. <clears throat> and then I, of course, got them in the pink color. These are just my favorite. Like, I love these colors. Obviously, <laughs> they have a lot of pink, but I just, these have to be one of my favorite dresses. I love the top, like, the neck here. The neckline, I thought that, would, like the ruffles, I thought that was so cute. And it's just so flowy and adorable and I can't wait to see them in this. Oh, so cute. And then the other things um, I got here, they had these um, when I was leaving the store. They always have like so much stuff, kind of like when you're leaving Sephora. So I ended up seeing these cool pool glasses. So I wanted to pick these up and I really like these. So it says donut ever leave me or let me go, which is so cute. Little donut on there. And I just realized we, we've been using glasses, like actual glasses when we're drinking outside. So I thought these would be a little bit nicer. Um, just not to, yeah, break anything. And these were $4.99. So they were a pretty good price too. And I like the colors, like the teal. And you guys know I like donuts. So 
So the last thing I got, this is actually kind of random. I didn't even know they had makeup there and I saw Lime Crime before I was leaving. So I was like, oh, this is kind of cool. I don't know if it's going to be good or not, but it was 30 bucks and those are the shades inside. But I haven't tried anything from Lime Crime, so I was really shocked that they had Lime Crime there. Let me know if you guys have tried anything from them before. So now into the next Marshalls bag. Um, so I ended up getting, it was Max's birthday the other day. So if you guys watched the q and I did on my main channel, it was his birthday. So I ended up getting him a few things and he's one years old now. Um, so I got him this right here. He loves Frisbee. Him and Ryan go to the park every day and play Frisbee and he's just like obsessed. He's such an athletic dog. So this one was $10, which isn't too bad of a price. And then right here, I like Max can swim. Oh, and I'll just do the tray first. So I got this really pretty tray. This is probably one of my favorite purchases. And this was $12.99, which is like an awesome price. So it's got gold all around the trim. And then it just had really fun colors. Um, at the bottom of the tray. I don't know where I'm gonna put this yet. I think I wanted to put it outside, like maybe on our dining table or once our um, patio seats come in, then I can like put this outside. I just thought it was really pretty. Okay, so I told you guys Max can swim. He picked that up right away. But just in case we have him in the pool for longer, I wanted to get him a life jacket and Ryan and I have been meaning to for so long now. Um, so I just got him this one right here, which is so cute, red. He's, he always wears red. And this one was $14.99. So I'm sure you guys will see that on Max in like another vlog. And then I also got him little balls here. He likes, um, he loves playing. I mean, with anything really, he has like a million toys, but he's just like a really athletic dog. So I've been trying to find like outdoorsy toys for him. So I've been meaning to get Max new bowls because he, he actually likes drinking out of this massive bowl that we have for him down there. Um, that's actually for the pool. So I'm like, you know what? Maybe we need to get him something bigger. Um, so I ended up getting him this one right here, which I thought was really, really cute. And it was on sale. It was $5 and it's gray. And then also this one right here. So, and this one was on sale too. This one was $7, and this I actually saw when I was leaving the store, you guys. I had to get it. It was just so cute for when I have my coffee lattes in the morning again, um, and it was just such a pretty little unicorn mug. I loved, like, the pastel colors. It's got, like, little stars on it, and it was just so pretty, and this was $6.99 can't show you what I got here but I know I did show you guys like on my insta stories it's called things engraved so I actually got the girl something engraved over there so the names are actually on on them I got them little rose gold um, jewelry like their little heart jewelry uh, holders and they're really beautiful like I can't wait to show you guys them and I did their names engraved um, so that's like the first engraving that I've done for them and I'm sure I'm gonna do lots more because I find that to be so special. And it's just something that they can keep for a really long time and treasure, so yeah. And then this I actually, I think this was, I forget what store this was, maybe Home or Hallmark. I got this at Hallmark, so they had this, our sweet girl's first, uh, very first year. So I thought I would use this for both of them because it says our sweet girls. So, um, yeah, because they were also a little bit expensive, but I could also, um, what's it called, separate it just by their name and everything like that in here. So it says, all babies are special, and it's just got all these like little stickers right here. So ba um, baby's first bath and stuff like that, all the first. And then story begins, it says, story continues, and then you're supposed to put like pictures in here. So it says place photo here. It's got like a m the month calendar right here and things we're saving there's like so many things photos uh, receipts doctor visit paperwork all sorts of stuff first kiss <laughs> Stuff like that so I'm gonna definitely use this I thought this was really cute okay and then these were just adorable our baby girl and I loved it how it had like a little elephant right there and it was light pink and I just thought these were so cute and I got these for $15.99 so I got two of course for both our girls um, so this one right here which I love it I think it's so cute so yeah Hallmark, Hallmark does have really really cute stuff um, especially like photo albums picture frames and stuff like that I saw a lot of wedding ones I actually want to go back and get one for our wedding so we can blow it up but I just thought these were so cute so of course my kitchen counter is full already um, but yeah that was everything that I picked up you guys so like Marshalls Bath and Body Works Garage Hallmark 
I know on my last vlog you guys said you wanted to kind of see what it is that I'm eating um, regularly so I just thought I'd show you guys and Ryan too it actually looks really really good um, so it's a quinoa salad I haven't put my quinoa on yet and then turkey that's turkey burger right and then turkey burger meat and then veggies and it looks really good I actually just stopped at Starbucks too this has been my favorite it's like the mango dragon fruit drink with no lemonade and then I got Ryan a coffee here you go hi Maxie kisses kisses <laughs> can't believe you're one already and here it is with the quinoa on top, which it's actually really, really good. And I got this quinoa from Home Sense a while ago. And yeah, just very healthy dinner. So I just thought I'd show you guys how I take photos. And um, for the most part, I take them in my beauty room. But I just wanted to show you like the equipment that I use, the settings and stuff like that. Because I get a lot of questions. So um, up here. So I put this light right here, which works really well. Now this came in a four-piece set. It's the It's Judy's Time set. Um, so I just use the one and then I usually focus it on whatever area that I'm trying to focus on which was this because um, In the photos I was actually putting like the clothes on the um, on the rack So you guys will see I usually turn my chandelier on just because I'm standing right here and it brings in some light And then I also have this one which this is the LED light So I just got this one pretty recently and it works really really well It has a mirror here too, which is nice. So you can actually change the settings on here. So I um, don't like to do the warm one because you can see, hold on, maybe it's on the other side. So this one is where you can change it to make it warm or cool toned, which I like that a lot more. It looks better. Um, so yeah, and then I was also using the ring light, this one here, which I have, but I do prefer this one a lot more and it's smaller. It's um, got better light, so that's what I like to use. So this is the camera here, it's the 5D Mark, and this is what I use for photos, for videos. Um, I don't use it that much for videos right now because I can't get the autofocus noise off and it really annoys me, so I do have this camera um, that I like to take for photos. I've been just using my vlog camera, honestly, a lot for um, all my videos right now, but I did want to show you. I have stuff everywhere, guys. Sorry, I had to rearrange. Now, this is a good camera if you're starting out. So this is like the 70D um, Canon. So this is the one that I used for YouTube for the first few years, and it works really, really well, you guys. I really highly recommend this camera, and sometimes I use it. I haven't used it in a while, though, probably since we moved here, but it is a good camera to start out with. I cannot remember the last time that I've been like this done up. I actually put lashes on today, you guys. I haven't worn lashes in a really, really long time. And the ones that I put on, not these ones, but they come in this packaging, the Sephora ones, which work really, really well. I really like these ones. These ones were too dramatic, so I didn't want to put those ones on, but I put the more natural ones on. And also, you guys, I went in this morning with the Born This Way concealer. This is like the most amazing thing I've ever used in my life. I don't know if you guys can tell, my under eyes are looking amazing today and I put it like right down my nose as well, forehead. I want to do a review for you guys really soon on this. I'm not sure if I'll do it on the vlog or the main channel, um, but just kind of talking about it more. And I can't believe how large this is. Like this is like the size of a foundation bottle. It's, it's really big. Um, but yeah, anyways. I have all the clothes here that I have to get into the nursery and also I wanted to let you guys know so on Monday we're actually getting the house painted and I'm really really excited and we're getting the wainscoting done so we're gonna be getting um, I think this room done or they're coming upstairs last so I think they're doing the dining room living room the staircase and then they're coming up in the bedrooms so um, if you guys know what wainscoting is it's pretty much that look where it has like the big picture frames on the wall and I'll probably insert a photo just so you guys know what it looks like I think it's so gorgeous though and a lot of my um, like YouTube friends have it like Liz she has it in her um, kitchen and it looks gorgeous so I'm really excited that we're getting it and I think it's just gonna change the entire look of the house so we're getting that done and then this room I'm actually doing half so it's gonna be half wainscoting and then the upper half of the wall is going to be light pink because I wanted to match the girls match the nursery so theirs will be light pink as well and then our guest room I think we're doing a light blue and then and then our master bedroom we're actually keeping all white so it's going to be completely wainscoted the entire room will be wainscoted with crown molding so the crown molding was a little expensive but it's our master bedroom and I want it to look very nice so I just wanted to let you guys know that so I will have a vlog and kind of showing you guys befores and afters of all the rooms so I'm really excited for that and yeah anyways 
I were off. We're actually going to an outlet area mall today to see what's there. And there's still so much stuff we have to buy, you guys. It's crazy. Um, honestly, it's crazy that we moved here from Vancouver with like nothing. You guys know we had no furniture because everything from a condo is obviously so much smaller. So we had to buy everything brand new. And I think we've done pretty good so far for an entire year of being here. Um, we've filled the house quite a bit, but there's still a lot that we still have to get, especially with the girls coming. Anyways, though, guys, I will talk to you guys in a bit. So I actually just got back from my massage. It was so nice. And I got an avocado toast, so it's just got tomatoes on it, salt and pepper, and it's gluten-free bread. And I'm not eating the sprouts. Um, but yeah, it's really, really good, tasty. So I'm back from my massage. I've actually been home for a few hours now, and I had a lot of work to do because I just had my new brushes arrive. I don't know if you can see them on the table there. So I've been upstairs um, taking photos, and my back started killing me. So I'm just taking a little break right now. But I just got a package from Maybelline, so I thought I'd show you guys really quickly what I got. So it's this cute little package that I got, and it's the Fit Me foundation right here, which I have tried before, and I really, really like this foundation. Um, so they have a lot of shades, by the way, so I'm just gonna open it this up. So it's matte and poreless, which is perfect. I love matte foundations, and look at all the shade varieties they have. So they have 40 different shades. And these were the three that I got. So I definitely want to try these out again because I haven't worn it in a really, really long time. Um, but yeah, I definitely will try them in an upcoming video for you guys. I just want to show you the little PR package I got. So this was the other PR package that I got that I was so excited for you guys. So it's the Too Faced Born This Way Super Coverage Multi-Use Sculpting Concealer. This was like the little package for it right here, flyer. And... Bam. Oh my goodness. This is like the most amazing thing ever. You guys know how much I love foundation and concealer. Complexion is everything for me. Um, I've already actually found my shade. So right here, I'm the light beige and I have it right here. I've been using it. It is the most amazing thing ever, you guys. I definitely want to do a full review. So if you look at the back here, it says conceal, contour, highlight, and retouch. So I've been using it underneath my eyes, but I've also been using it for highlighting, retouching as well. And it's just amazing. It's gives very flawless coverage um, but they have so many shades you guys like look at the shade collection so crazy and these are huge by the way they are like almost the size of a foundation so really really excited about their new launch hey guys so I am just in the car right now I'm actually waiting for Ryan he just ran into the paint store so I told you guys and I'm wearing my mama shirt mama bear and oh we are actually getting our house painted on Monday, so that's why we're picking out the color paints, but I wanted to see the book. So I'm sure they have lots of shades to choose from, like of pink, so I wanna make sure I like nail the color pink for both the nursery and then my beauty room. And we actually just stopped at Starbucks. We've got both our phones here. So this is that new drink at Starbucks. It's the mango dragon fruit, and it's so good, you guys. It's really, really good. And um, I get it with no lemonade. I just think it tastes better, and it's less less sugary. And then Ryan always gets his dark roast coffee. And right after, we're actually going to the outlet mall because I haven't been there in ages, and I kind of want to see what they have. So they've got, like, some baby stores there, I think, decor stores. So we're just going to check it out today and have, like, an easygoing Saturday. And, yeah, prepare for next week which I'm really really excited about you guys I can't wait to actually have like the house painted it's gonna be so pretty <laughs> show you guys what we got from the outlet we didn't get too many things and they only had like a few good baby stores but I didn't get anything for myself right I didn't get anything either um, but I just wanted to show you guys what we got so we stopped with the gap the gap and sorry my hair's a mess right now it was actually just raining so I got soaked um, but we got these two little cardigans so I thought these would be perfect for when they're wearing like a fancier dress and I just thought these were really nice and they are 12 to 18 months. So we got two of those. So cute. And they were actually on sale. So they were $15 each, so $30 altogether. And then we stopped at the children's place. This one, one of my favorite stores. It's the cutest stuff. So we got these ones here. Ryan chose these ones. 
they're so cute. Look at these. So it comes with a little t-shirt and the, the little pants. Here's say Daddy's Little Princess. I thought they were so cute. And these ones are the three to six months. So we got two of those. And then we got these little sockies right here. So they already have lots of socks, but I just want to make sure that I have enough. So they came in a little set like that. And then these were really cute. I picked up these leggings and they're six to nine. And they kind of frill at the bottom like that. They're really cute though. So we got two light pink ones. And then these shirts right here, it says Tierra Hair Don't Care Princess Life. So these are six to nine. Look how cute these ones are. I really like these little onesies. So we got two of those. And then this one says Beautiful Like Mommy Adored by Daddy. These were the first ones that we picked up actually. They're so cute. This one right here. And this one. So lastly, we just got some plain zero to three uh, onesies right here. And I haven't bought like anything plain yet. Everything's been either pink. Oh, Maxie's saying hi. Hi, Maxie. So yeah, everything's been pink, detailed, um, or pretty dressy. So I just wanted to get some really plain ones. And is that it? Oh, and then you guys all know Ryan loves no. Detroit Tigers. No. So we got these right here. They're little bibs. No. How cute, no. look at these. So we found these there. So it says Little Detroit Tigers fan, little bibs. So I'm actually just in my washroom right now and I'm about to have a bath, but I thought I would show you guys what I've been using um, for my pregnancy, for skincare, and then also for my belly. And I've found some stuff that's really been working. Um, ever since I've been pregnant though, um, I've been using my bio oils. So I've pretty much gone through, I think one full bottle already. Um, but I'm getting low, so I have to get another one. But anyways, I thought I'd show you guys just everything that I'm using right now. So this is like my little skincare area, and I showed you guys these in one of my last vlogs. So this is kind of what it looks like, just this like acrylic holder, and I've got this one right here, and then also my soap dispenser, which I really like them. I think they look really, really nice. Obviously, we don't have a lot in our washroom right now. I want to get a painting here, and then a painting over top of the, um, the bath as well the bathtub but yeah anyways i just wanted to quickly show you guys what i've been using and loving for my pregnancy so first product right here josie moran whipped argan oil now this is my third i think or second bottle and what i love about josie moran is that her line is completely all natural and this one is the whipped argan oil ultra hydrating body butter and you guys i live by this stuff and i actually watched another youtuber and she um swore by this when she was pregnant so i bought it and it really works so well you guys it just leaves your belly feeling so hydrated um i put it all over my skin though so that's why i run out so quickly and then right here we also have this i got this from um, a baby boutique so it's called substance and it's the belly jelly just to show you guys what it looks like in when you um when you put it on your belly it actually uh, dissolves into an oil but right here it actually has shea butter oats and lavender so it smells like lavender it smells really good though so i put that on and then the last thing that I wanted to show you guys just got a ton of stuff down here as well I have to do some organizing down here because it's just craziness right now anyways the, so I've got the bio oil I need to go get another bottle because I'm almost out so this is another product that I use from substance so the leg and back cream which smells really good it's kind of strong though it smells overly strong but it works really well I did pick this up from HomeSense but I haven't used it yet it's the rose hip oil so I might try this out as well um, with my bio oil but I find the bio oil is just like it's a miracle worker you guys and it prevents stretch marks and it's just your go-to when you're pregnant um, okay, so for skincare, I've been using the Josie Moran Argan Cleansing Oil. Now this is really nice. Um, it's a little heavier than I liked it to be, so I have to say that I do like the Tatcha one that I had more, the Camellia Cleansing Balm or cleansing oil, but this one, it works well. It's just very thick, so like, I find I can't use it just as an oil. I have to actually like wet my skin to apply this because it's really thick, but I'm just using it for now. And then right here, we also have the Rose Toner by Fresh. Now this is a miracle worker, you guys. It leaves your skin feeling so hydrated, and I use it morning and night. Um, and yeah, toner always was one of the things I'd skip, but I've noticed a huge difference in my skin since I've used that. And then right here, we have the Youth Preserve Face Cream. So I've been using this. It's very hydrating morning and night. And then right here, we have the Origins is the Eye Doctor. So I've been using this and liking it. I actually liked this more. It was a little sample I picked up from Fresh, the black tea. 
age delay eye concentrate so i want to go pick this up in full size i know it's expensive i think it's a hundred dollars but i might just do it because it worked really well and then i sometimes use this one the josie moran 100 percent uh pure argan oil just if i want to really hydrate my skin i'll use that like once a week this i'm almost out of um so this was a serum the sos thirst by caudalie and i hardly have like any left you guys it worked really well so i've just been using this for right now the ceo sunday riley rapid flash serum but i think i'm gonna go pick another one of this one up because it's been working really well anyways you guys that is everything i've been using for skincare and i like to stick to like all natural brands for right now just because i'm pregnant so josie moran really highly recommend her products you guys like they work really well and then substance also if you can find that that's a mom line that you can buy as well and then fresh cosmetics you guys already know um which is like a really nice brand um at sephora and i just love their products anyways you guys that's probably where i'm gonna leave this vlog i know it's kind of a random vlog it's been kind of a random week but a lot is happening next week so i'm really excited to share with you guys all the updates and i appreciate all the love you guys have been sending my way on instagram um and i've been posting lots of belly photos so if you guys want to follow me on instagram go check me out and yeah thank you guys for all the support on also the vlog channel i can't believe we hit over 40k once we hit 50k i'm gonna do a massive giveaway for you guys because i appreciate it so much um but yeah anyways i will see you guys in my next vlog bye